and in today's video we're going to be looking at Microsoft's OneDrive Live and PowerPoint, something I very very rarely if not ever use but I will be from now because it's got this amazing thing that you see on screen called Rehearse with Coach something I believe, might be wrong, but believe that Google Slides does not do. So what you see on screen here is your rehearsal report where I did this as a test uh, notice that my microphone is active on my Windows 10 laptop I did a quick test of these slides and I spoke for 1 minute and 25 seconds in 4 slides I spoke at 135 words a minute I used the word um too much and the little filler here told me and also it gives a average pace over time and also an originality uh, report so the best thing to do is demo it before I demo it I'm going to look at the suggestions from the presenter coach so this is a free product from Microsoft this is PowerPoint of course or OneDrive or whatever it's called suggestions from the presenter coach it gives you a summary so it must my guess is record your microphone take it up to the cloud real-time feedback everything and then gives you things like pace tips uh, when you speak too fast audience members uh, can't understand what you're saying if you speak too slowly they will lose interest and <laughs> fall asleep probably then you've got certain words um, per minute meaning 100 to 165 mine was what 135 um, it will give you pop-ups on the right side of the screen at the bottom amazing and then it also gives you more tips tips which I will not go into now but the filler words I will because they're really interesting because you've got you know as a teacher myself um, sensitive phrases things like um, if you say policemen of course you may think about saying police officers things like that modern speech then it gives you some bias disability age gender sexual orientation race and mental health ethnic slurs originality uh, number on slides so let's do the thing shall we so what we're going to do is um, that was the summary report if I step back it will be like this when we finish and for another video I'm making I was actually doing something um, comparing how this works online uh, with OneDrive so in other words I've got four slides to get through so just as an idea file home along the top where it's slide show and then play the from, from beginning which I was going to do anyway play from the current slide rehearse with coach so I'm just going to do this four slide presentation probably in about 60 seconds I'm speaking to you on my zoom h1 but I've also got a little headset microphone plugged into my windows machine so let's do this shall we So then, you can see on the bottom right of the screen, it says, Welcome, welcome to PowerPoint Presenter Coach. As your rehearsal, we'll give you some feedback, yada, yada, start. And then and notice it says that straight away, um, at the end, you'll see um, su su suggestions. Sorry, can't speak. Bottom right, mic is ready. It means it can hear me. But remember, just because my first slide is on screen, that doesn't mean that the actual rehearsing has started. So let's start the rehearsing proper. Sorry, I'm holding my mic from the right hand and my hand's getting stiff, so sorry about that. So right, three, two, one, start rehearsing. Here we go then. So um, some recent trees is something I photographed in autumn. See, so he says, say, don't use um. <laughs> what you can see here is a lovely oak tree in autumn. I took this photo, I think only goodness me was it yesterday or the day before that as I stood with my mobile phone and it was literally raining in a cloudy sky what I saw is literally three one two three oak trees uh, leaves just passing me by as I clicked the shutter in the same exact time I took another picture which looks like this you might recognize this tree tree because it is my profile shot um, and I've updated it the one previous with the leaves Unusually, in November here, late November, you've actually got quite a lot of um, almost like bleached fields here, which is really weird because I think the farmer's actually gone along there and irrigated with some kind of um, chemical to make it go a bit bleachy. So after that, I think we're going to be stepping back in a moment to see how we got on with this rehearser, and I will click to stop on the bottom right of screen right now. Right, so we have stopped the rehearser. 
I'm going to press escape then here we go that was what I've just done so I just actually properly rehearsed for 1 minute 12 again four slides you avoided reading slide text aloud that's good for keeping the audience engaged with your message learn more I could click it this time interesting I did 137 words per minute maybe that's my normal speaking voice on this YouTube channel I've actually made 1259 videos public this will be the 1260th video public there was my pace and then I've got sensitive phrases I didn't use any in this particular one obviously it was an example and once again it picked me up immediately on look to sound more polished and confident try to avoid using filler words pause or take a breath to relax some filler words to avoid are um and so there you've got and then I could actually go again look and make sure that I can knock out the word um and then provide feedback and all that great stuff so look have have a great time with this I think it's a super super useful tool I'd love to see myself or you or anybody listening or watching this video to see what happens if you literally spoke for 30 minutes over like you know 25 slides or something because that really you know test the AI I guess it's AI that's working with Microsoft good job Microsoft this was a very very good find and thank you it's free of charge